the name of Jesus, I knew that if I waited long enough looking at the sky, I would see one of these events take place. I'm 100% convinced they're of a spiritual nature. They are not physical, where the government is sending planes like this. They are completely a spiritual event. Of the type they are, I'm not 100% certain. I ask for discernment of the Lord on that. I have a feeling, because Satan is a great deceiver, that they actually could be both. They could be good from God and deception from the devil. So, that's my thought on what those things are that come out of the portals. Another thought I have is God put all the creatures here and he says he'll remove the creatures. And look what ha is happening in the Amazon. Creatures that weren't even discovered yet are being removed. The kingdom of God draws nigh. Except Jesus today. Today, this moment, as I speak this, it's not too late. There's an urgency I feel in my spirit for this. The peace of God to you all. There was only that one. I'm more inclined to think that they're angels or they're dead in Christ rising. Or they could be from the darkness, I don't know. One guy's convinced they are, one lady's convinced they're the rapture. And I think they're spiritual and I think they're both. So that's what God has decided to show me today. And if you've seen any of my other video, you saw where the Lord showed me an instrument to the right of the sun. It just came out and it was only visible in the camera format, not by the naked eye. That video is on my channel. It's shaped like a bow without the string. God showed me that. He showed me, he's shown me so much and I want to thank him right now for opening my eyes to the truth. That every word of God, that every word of God in the Bible, it is true. Every word is true. And Bible prophecy is unfolding daily. Please ask God to open your ears to hear and your eyes to see. Because not everything is as it seems. It never was. Just like people that stigmatize crows because they're black and say they're bad birds. But if you study them, you can learn a lot from birds. So, so I'm ending it by saying, remember Jesus has said he gave unto us a new commandment that thou shall love our God our Father above all else. There's so much other things people love in the world more than God. Money, a family member, uh, whatever. And the second commandment is likened to the first, that we love our neighbor as we love ourselves. And neighbors sure aren't very good neighbors to each other anymore. They're either recluse themselves or they gang up and bully one or two people in the complex of neighbors in the neighborhood. It's wretched. It's wretched. The birds know it. God knows it. I don't know who they think they're kidding. But God promises that all that's in darkness will be revealed in light. All. And my faith in God is not shakable at all. Thank you, God, for removing my afflictions and persecutions and stamping them, allowing me the honors, crushing them under my feet. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen.